For this problem, we want to use transformations in the graph of f of x equals x cubed to graph g of x equals negative x plus 1 cubed plus 1. g of x is equal to negative f of x plus 1 plus 1. The negative function means that we will reflect the graph over the x-axis. So our new points are now at 1, negative 1, and negative 2, 4. Connecting the points, we get the graph of negative f of x. Adding 1 to the function means that we will shift our new graph up by one unit. So our new points are at negative 2, 5, and 1, 0. Connecting the points, we get the graph of negative f of x plus 1. Adding 1 to x means that we will shift the new graph to the left by one unit. So our new points are at negative 3, 5, and 0, 0. Connecting the points, we get the graph of g of x, and this is the final answer.